fifth straight year, the Midwestern State men's soccer team is hosting Colorado Mesa in the NCAA tournament. The Mustangs are 5-1 and one against the Mavericks overall, and they're hoping to knock Mesa out of the postseason tournament for the fourth season in a row. Tonight, Abby Loring shines this week's sports spotlight on the MSU men's soccer team as they head into their 14th NCAA tournament. The Midwestern State men's soccer team has already accomplished a lot in this 2018 season, snagging their third straight Heartland Conference Championship and posting a 16-1-2 record heading into the NCAA tournament. But the Mustangs are not satisfied. MSU made it all the way to the national quarterfinals last season, falling to Cal Poly Pomona in penalty kicks. A loss, leaving the Mustangs hungry. You know, had that devastating loss and penalty kicks in the Elite Eight, you know, kind of kind of sucks, but like, it's that chip on our shoulder that we need to prove ourselves that we're better than what was ha what happened last year. The Mustangs are focusing on the present challenge, taking on Colorado Mesa in the second round of the tournament. The Mavericks and the Mustangs are far from being strangers. Last season, MSU defeated Mesa 3-0, knocking them out of the tournament for a third year in a row. In 16, arguably they were better than us, and we just kind of snuck one out late and in the, like the 88th minute and got them and kind of. 15 and 17, we've we, we we had some good groups and we were able to get them. But they'll be an athletic team. They're got a handful of seniors that are very good, that are returning, that have played against us for a lot of years, and so we're familiar with them. They're familiar with us. I think the best players play well on the best occasions, and I know our team is good enough. So I think we're all going to rise to it, and uh, it's just another game for us. You know, like we feel we're the best team in the country, so I'm not worried about anyone else and anyone being nervous, please. They should be nervous first. So. In his first year as head coach, Michael Meacham received Heartland Conference Coach of the Year honors after leading the Mustangs to sixth in the national rankings. So we're on the field, we grind every day. Meach runs us enough to be number six. I feel like I feel like we run top ten in the nation. So we just every day, like not just running, like we're we're working every day. We're in the weight room every day. We're on the field, we're stretching. We're training every day, like there's no days off, and that's like for real, no days off. And that's the difference between, I guess, being the best and being just good. In the days leading up to the tournament, the Mustangs are back at work because from this point on, it's win or go home. Well, I mean, we're only guaranteed 90 minutes for sure now. And I mean, just going in with a confident mindset because they're coming to play us at our place. And uh, it's been three years since they beat us. and. I think that's just the biggest thing is just kind of going in there and playing our own game rather than playing at other people's levels. So if we play our game, I think we'll come out with a win. Just like rest the body, rest the mind because it's a big game, big occasion, especially going down the stretch, you know, like it's going to be bigger teams, bigger games. So we really got to like get our bodies and minds right first before we start thinking about anything soccer related. This already successful team is not done just yet. The Mustangs have their eyes set on five more wins and a national championship. Abby Loring, KFDX3 Sports. Midwestern State ranks sixth in the nation, hosting 25th ranked Colorado Mesa at Stang Park, one o'clock kickoff on Sunday afternoon. That'll